Good afternoon, traders. It's Raul from Alpha Shark. Today is uh, Tuesday, August 9th, 2016. And today I want to show you guys how we've been trading the S&P 500 futures using our proprietary based uh, newest indicator, the SV Scalper. And uh, the S and the V stand for strength and volume. And pretty much that's the premise of this indicator. Finding areas in the market um, where there is strength and using the volume of that strength in order to uh, achieve the best possible trade location. So a lot going on in this chart right now. Um, the first thing you guys might notice is, hey, hey, Raul, what are these uh, green and black bars on each one of my bars? The green and the black line are the mean and the mode. And it's the mean and the mode of the volume that traded at that specific bar. I'll repeat that one more time. It is the mean and the mode of the volume that traded at that bar. The main purpose of it is for trade location. Now, as for strength in the market, uh, we can see those displayed as arrows above a bar and below a bar. Arrow below a, uh, above a bar, we want to be sure if and only if that bar is in a negative trend. The bars already come preloaded um, in the color of the trend so that it's uh, much, much easier to identify. And uh, we want to be long, arrow below a bar, if and only if the trend is positive. So let's run through a couple exercises here, a couple of the trades we took. Uh, we see a sell signal here, uh, negative trend bar. So we want to be short. We want to be short at the mean and the mode. Okay, we achieve our trade location. This one gave us about 50 to 75 cents, um, which was the profit target at the time. Uh, the profit targets does, uh, do change over time. And they're also displayed here on the upper left hand, uh, upper left hand of the uh, chart. Okay. And it's displayed in points. So once we enter the market, we want to take max profit one point. <clears throat> okay. Uh, so this one gave us uh, a little less, but we're scalping, right? We're looking to hit base hits, not really hit home runs all the time. Uh, sometimes the market will give us a home run, though. Sell signal over a bar, negative trend. We got the trade location we were looking for, and the market gave us a gift with this negative bar, and uh, definitely got our profit target on that one. Uh, arrow above this bar, positive trend we don't take arrow above this bar this bar specifically was frustrating held it for about uh, 20 minutes and it really didn't produce anything so we ended up scratching in it um, didn't take this long because positive uh, the trend is not positive uh, short signal here trend is uh, positive so we don't take that one long signal negative trend we don't take it long signal positive trend this one we take, we get the trade location we're looking for. Unfortunately, at this bar right here, we do get stopped out. Uh, almost immediately, we get a long signal, get the trade location we were looking for. Uh, this one could have given us at least 75 cents if we traded it perfectly, but if we went for the full profit target, it did not work out. Uh, and also started, you know, just a lot of chop, just like we had in this area. Same thing uh, over here. And then the uh, sell program started to hit the market, creating volatility and volatility is opportunity. So I was definitely uh, looking for opportunities here. So we get a long signal here. This one we don't take because the trend is negative. Uh, short signal here. This one we take gave us the profit, uh, not the profit, the uh, trade location we were looking for. And it also gave us the profit target we're looking for. And, uh, you know, for the rest of the day, we really, really didn't get uh, any signals. This one I haven't taken because uh, making a video for you guys here. Uh, but long signal here, negative trend we don't take. And uh, so just a few winners, a scratch, and a loser is what we got uh, with the indicator today. But we're only looking to scalp the market. And that's the whole uh, basis of the indicator looking for areas where we can get high probability scalps guys and this is how we've been trading the S&P 500 futures uh, I'm sure there will be more videos to come and uh, everybody enjoy the rest of your trading day and as always happy trading